Resident Doctors Association of Zambia has called off the impending ghost law that was scheduled to start tomorrow. RDAZ President Brian Sampa says this is as a result of the engagement with government. He says the association is satisfied with what has been concluded in the meeting. Dr. Sampa has since urged all health workers to go for work tomorrow and provide quality health care. He told ZMBC this evening that his members will be updated on the payment of arrears by government. Uh, following the engagements which we've had with the government, as of today, they have pledged that uh, starting this week, the government has committed to start the payments of the, the doctors, those who've been owed from 2015 up to date. They have pledged to start dismantling the setting in allowances, the um, gratuities, and also the salary arrears. That's not all. The government has further pledged to employ the 500 doctors in phases, starting with at least 128 the coming week, until these doctors are all employed, so that they don't continue languishing without work. On top of that, the government has also worked through, uh, through negotiations with RDZ and the other stakeholders, come up with a plan on how they intend to create more positions for registrars, uh, SRMOs, and also GRMOs, so that all these doctors who keep on working on administrative positions can no longer do so, but have to work on substantive positions. It is at the backdrop of this and the other engagements we are yet to have that I wish to inform the nation that the impending ghost law has been cancelled and I therefore urge all our members countrywide to go for work starting Monday. Government says it remains committed to dismantling areas owed to health workers in a phased manner. Public Service Management Division Permanent Secretary Bonfest Chumbwali says as an interim measure, government has committed to release some funds next week that will go towards dismantling of the accumulated debt for health workers, including doctors. He says doctors should remain dedicated to duty as government is addressing their concerns. Mr. Chumbwali says government is aware of the hard work that doctors put in when serving lives and will ensure that the plight of the health workers is continuously improved. He, however, warned that doctors who will go against the resolution that will that will go against the, re the resolution will individually be held responsible for their actions. He said this during a press briefing in Osaka today, attended by Ministry of Information and Broadcasting Services Permanent Secretary Amos Malupenga and Labor Commissioner Givens Muntengwa. Mr. Chimwali has assured members of the public that there will be no disruption of services at health institutions following its engagements with the doctor's leadership. In fact, as we were doing the fast track recruitment, we had to begin to work backwards. We recruited the nurses and doctors uh, outside the procedures so that no life is lost. Ultimately, we have ensured all the nurses and doctors whom we recruited are now on payroll without late. And every civil servant gets their salary tenuously. Do we, do we owe uh, staff? Yes, we do. Are we doing something about this? Yes, we are. You recall, I have been on record from PSMD uh, and cabinet supporting that we look at the issue of staff date. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, leave a comment and subscribe.